What up, what up, what up, y'all? It's your boy, Matt Big Body Cole. And this is my last video for 2016, man. Big Body Trucking. And this shit right here, it's a Big Body Production, y'all. Hey, look here, man. Yo, I'm gonna be straight up and get right to this. Hmm, where we yawn? I had to kick some shit to the curb, man. You know, 2016 was a hell of a year. I went dumpster diving, looking for gold in the trash. It still came up with scraps. Not scrap metal, just scrap trash. Um, yo, um, niggas and bitches that were once a part of my circle, gone. Only, the only ones in, that are gonna remain are the ones that I continue to speak to. Y'all know who y'all are, and if y'all don't, and you won't hear it from me. I want to give a special shout outs to Warren Williams, Will Spencer, Leon Jones, B Hack, Dwayne McCray, Don McKeithen, DC, Devilon Chapman. Yo, they the uh they the ones that got me where I need to be mentally. They dropped the game on me when it comes to this shit, man. I got some things in motion. For 2017. They're put in place right now, but they'll be in motion in 2017. I also want to say um, to the females that got dropped off, y'all can say what y'all want to say. I don't give a fuck. At the end of the day, I can afford to tell you bitches bye. And, um, you know, I'm going to start off like this. I'm going to go down the list. To that, uh, that one chick, you know. That pregnant chick, see you in June. Uh, that mouthy bitch with all the motherfucking mouth and wanna act like, you know, your shit don't stink. You see what that got you. It'll be even worse as life goes on for you. Fucking with niggas like me or fucking with niggas worse than me. So you better just get your toy ready and pop yourself off. Cause it's gonna be a long time. Grab a Snickers while you at it. And the high yellow bitch. They think somebody owes her something with the fucking light skin girl attitude. You just a miserable scorn fuck. I really hope and pray that you seek the proper counseling and medication that you need to bring you back to what you used to be. Cause what you are right now is a waste of time. Oh yeah, and to that cesspool smelling Dog shit complexioned ass ungrateful bitch. I want nothing to ever do with you or your using ass ways ever again. I'm tired of carrying you. Fuck you, bitch. Be the parent that you need to be. And um, if you don't, that's on you. I did my part. I have no need to be around for that no more. It's time to do me. And the way I'm gonna do me is doing what I need to do and what I set out to do. It's none of your business. If you don't know, then don't worry about it. But what I want to say is this, though. Oh, yeah, it's payday, niggas. You know, I can afford to tell you. You see that? You see that? Yeah, you know. That's how it comes in by the week, you know? That's what I say. I can tell you bye. See, you got to understand one thing. A wise man by the name of Warren Williams once told me, you get plenty of fucking pussy chasing money, but you don't get no money chasing pussy. Pussy's gonna fall on my lap. Am I out just to get pussy? No. Who wants to be lonely? Nobody. I'm not trying to be lonely. I'm trying to get this money. And I honestly, I would love to share it with someone of caliber. But I'm not going to have no shit ass come around. I'm not going to have no shit. Yeah, that was a $950 check, by the way. Uh, I'm 
gonna have no shit ass woman come around and fake jacks to eat a piece of the pie or act like she fucking gives a fuck about me or tell me she loved me but, she, but acts real combative and defensive towards me. I don't got time for that shit. Or a bitch talking about she loves me but she suffers from a mental condition that has nothing to do with the price of tea in China. Because if it was all like that, chick, you wouldn't have a job. If your mental issue was that deep like you claim, your employer would say, bitch, bye. And to the niggas that want to laugh and smile on your face, or stab you in the back, behind, behind the back, or act like they want to do something with your money, they want an investment tip, and they come up with a song and a dance and a reason why shit ain't what it, they said it was going to be. Look at here, man. You got to go. You got to go. I don't have time for setbacks, man. And I want you people to understand something. You yeah, tune into my video and, why, and videos or video and watch what I say. Okay? In the famous words of my man B. Hack. Watch what I say. No, hear what I say, but watch what I do. I'm gonna say it again. And I'm gonna give the credit to where it's due because I didn't pioneer this shit. He did. And it makes a lot of sense. Hear what I say, but watch what I do. Um, This shit right here, y'all, this shit right here is a big body production, man. You know, I, I call this a thousand dollar week production. That's what that's that's how I'm coming. It's where I'm able to say, you know what? Fuck y'all, get away from me. Get the fuck away from me. If you're not moving in the direction where I'm trying to move, if it's not about getting this money and building, because all that cacking and combative shit and all that kick, 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 and all that hating and negative shit, don't get me wrong. I got some ways with me. But at the end of the day, I'm still focused and following what I need to what I need to do for me. But um, hey, see if I can take this right here. You know, I landed myself in a pretty damn good position with this Amazon shit, man. And who did it? I did it. I did it. Yes, me. Pat myself on the back, give myself a cookie. Oh, why not? You know why? Because I said, you know what? I'm done out here doing illegal shit. I'm done out here trying to be legal and illegal at the same time. I'm just going to do what I need to do for me. And hey, man, if I got to go without for a minute, so be it. But I want to make sure I get right. And that's what the fuck I did, man. I'm not going to let nobody steal my joy, man. Trucking is my shit. Trucking is what I love to do. I'm one of the few motherfuckers you know that can work 30 days straight, seven days a week, twice a day, two jobs. Come on, man. Then break it down to just one job and still maintain, man. Still maintain. So, you know, I'm going to say this much, man. I did everything I needed to do for 2016. Unfortunately, I slipped up. Got a little kid on the way. I deal with that accordingly. <laughs> oh, man. But this shit right here, y'all. It's trucking, baby. It's fucking trucking, man. And once again, I want to give a special... I want to give a special thank you and shout out to my man Warren Williams. Because he's the one that really dropped the game on me. The start of it. The start of it, man. Hey, Warren, you going to stop talking about my little ass truck. With that big ass broken down 53 foot box of bullshit you driving, nigga. I ain't broke. <laughs> hey, Warren, I ain't broke down yet. You notice that? You notice that? Hey, Warren. Let's go to the way station. Let's see who comes out first, bitch. <laughs> nah, that's my nigga though, man. Hey, hey Warren, man. I appreciate everything, bro. So, uh, to all y'all out there, 
that's waiting for another Chris Smith beef or waiting for me to argue with this person and that person. Not doing all that, man. We sticking to the money, baby. We sticking to the money, man. Sticking to the plan. But, uh, come on, get the fuck from behind me, man. Damn. People be swearing they... Tell you what, man. I'll have a good rest of the year. And if you don't like anything I've said or done in my videos, I'm gonna steal this one from the angry man to all the haters. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Yo, Valdez, I needed to. My bad, bro. <coughs> you put on my tab, all right? Uh, all y'all got an issue with me? Fuck you! Hey, man, my dad always told me, man. The famous Robert Cole himself always told me. You got niggas that wake up in the morning trying to spend your money. You always will have a nigga that wakes up in the morning looking to figure out how they can spend your bread. So what you have to do is you have to check your area operation Clear yourself from surroundings and focus on you first. And then when you know what you got around you, then move forward. When you know who you are and you know what you want to do, you move forward. And you make sure you keep your snakes out your fucking garden. With that being said, 2016. Later, y'all. See you next year, y'all. I'm about to go cash that check. Oh, you don't believe me?